This video will demonstrate automatic coding using the style or structure of a document. This kind of autocoding relies on the use of heading styles in the transcript, which can be applied in Microsoft Word or Envivo. I can use this formatting to gather all responses to a question across transcripts to code for that question. To view formatting, open an interview. Click on the edit option and click on a question heading. Each question has been formatted as a heading style one in this example. This style is applied to all questions in all the sample interview transcripts. Now I am ready to autocode. Select the interviews in list view. Right click and select autocode from the menu. A wizard opens with several types of automatic coding. Choose the option, use the style or structure. Then click next. In step two, leave it at paragraph styles and click next. In the next screen, I can see that there are two heading styles applied in this document, heading one and heading two. I want to use heading one because this is the heading that is used for each question. To select, click heading one and then click the arrow to move it to the right pane. Then click next. Now Invivo asks where you want to put these new codes. Make a new folder under codes and name it interviews by question. Click finish. Envivo has created a code for each question. Open the code to view all responses to that question across the interview transcripts. Question 6 duplicated because the heading was typed inconsistently in one transcript. Merging these codes will solve the problem. See the Managing Codes video in the coding lesson for details. Autocoding by style or structure works best with structured or semi-structured interviews or focus groups. Your questions need not be asked in the same order for the autocoding to work, as long as you use the same heading for each question. Cheer Chain Enterprise distributes and sells software with the aim of offering clients guidance. When choosing software, as well as technical support, 